guys. Welcome back to Crypto Talk Nap, where we talk about all things crypto. We talk about it every day and every night. I'm your host, Larry. We've got a good show for you today. Today, we're going to be featuring a coin we haven't talked about on this show. It's called GMR Finance. We're feeling pretty bullish about this. Again, it's not financial advice. Comment below in the comment section. Let us know if you are currently invested in this coin or if you'd like more information about it. Or tell me also what you're bullish on and what you'd like us to start covering on this channel. Please smash the like button. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do this for more videos like this. Okay, guys, let's go over here and jump at the screen and take a look at coin market cap. So what we've got going on here is GMR Finance. Let's refresh the screen. We are currently up nicely in the green, 35% on the day. I like this one because it's not an Ethereum. I, of course, like the Ethereum coins, but the gas fees are very expensive, as you guys know. So this one is on the Binance Smart Chain. The fees are very low to get into this. It is also in a couple other exchanges. We'll get into that in a minute. But let's just go over here. I wanted to show you guys something that currently it went through an audit through Certec, which is very good. It gives us some peace of mind. So you can see right here, it's got a score of 91 and you guys can go over to this website if you want to read more about the details. Flipping back over to CoinMarketCap, we'll show you here on the seven day where we got in on this. We got in approximately seven days ago, right around seven days ago. And I'm trying to go back and remember here, we got in actually right here over on the third, right over in this area here, the volume was around 3.4 million. And then we kind of wrote it up here. We sold off about 75% of our holdings in this token right around here just a couple of days later. We weren't really sure if we we're going to hold it. And then from there, it went down. And then just right here yesterday, we purchased more of it on the 9th. Volume was a little lower, around 1 million. And then we've been riding it up and we've decided to make it a long-term hold. And we're going to get into the reasons why. So one of the reasons is... The fact that they passed their audit, we looked a little closer at this, and we also can see, we'll refresh it here, we've got holders, is really a good amount of holders, 215,000 holders. That is really strong. Now, going over to their Twitter page, they have a good, strong community of over 71,000 followers, so we like that as well. And then coming over here, let's go take a look at their website. So I'm just going to read you a little bit of this. I think their graphics is really good, too. This is a gaming crypto. And I think gaming cryptos and metaverse cryptos are going to be very hot, especially coming into going into the year uh, 2022. But let me just read this for you. So GMR Finance, non-fungible leets. That's a different concept here. So out now. Non-fungible leets, NFLs, are randomly generated NFTs. Each of the 10,000 battle-ready NFLs have inbuilt rarity determiners and are completely unique. If you are fortunate enough to mint one of these NFLs, you will be rewarded a 5% royalty on all future sales of NFLs. So that's pretty cool, guys. You're actually going to be able to get an actual royalty when you sell your NFT or your NFL. So this, you can go into more detail and look at their website. Like I said, I think it's pretty well laid out. The graphics are good. This is where we can purchase these. So you can purchase them on PancakeSwap like we did. Or if you have a centralized exchange like Bitmark or Hotbit, you can go onto these exchanges and purchase these coins as well. You can see that they're on CoinMarketCap, CoinGecko. So that's, that's a good thing here. There's another exchange, TZT Global. I'm not familiar with that one. The tokenomics, guys, is a reason a real big reason why we've decided to hold this long term. So if you look at the breakdown right here, they originally started with one quadrillion in total supply. They burned 50% at launch and they have 5% going into their development team for the developers and 5% went into a marketing wallet for marketing. So that's, that's healthy. Uh, over here, the transaction is what we really like, guys. So if you guys are invested in Saitama and familiar with the reflections or somebody like uh, one of the tokens like Catgirl, so with Saitama, you're getting a 2% reflection. So for just holding it, you're getting 2%, you're sharing in 2% of the redistribution every time someone buys or sells. Well, with this particular coin, GMR Finance is actually higher than that. So, you know, we really love Saitama, but this one even pays even more. It pays uh, 5%. So you get 5% 
uh, sharing in those reflections. This is out of the 10% redistribution fee. So every time there's a transaction buy or sell, this is what the breakdown is. 3% of it is burned and 2% goes back into the liquidity pool. So we just touched on the surface on this coin, guys. It, remember to do your own research. Take a closer look at this coin, this token. Let us know your comments down below, what you think about it. If, you, if you're bullish on it like we are, we're trying to bring you some good, what we think are good investments. Remember, it's not financial advice. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Smash the like button so others can find out about this. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the next video.